Okay, folks, I'm just shooting video uh, with my cell phone, phone video camera of the uh, playback on the monitor right now. And the playback on the monitor is only a fraction of the quality of the actual live uh, video that you get while flying. Uh, again, the quality of the recording of the built-in DVR is very, very poor, but the live image that you're getting while flying right off the monitor is superb. All right, here we go. I had to take off uh, not on the grass because it was so wet it would have put water on my lens right away. Now see that video noise that you're getting that right there? Uh, that's not on the live image. That video noise that you get there is not on the live image at all. Uh, nor is the uh, sort of changing of the color of the grass not on the live video. The live video is perfect. It's focused. It's superb. It's a very sharp, crisp. Uh, all the colors are fantastic. Um, it's just absolutely superb. The live video is superb. Uh, unlike this. See all that? You don't get any of that on the live video. So from now on, I'm going to record I'm going to use my high-definition action camera to record the uh, live video uh, video image off the monitor, which is perfect. The live video image is perfect, so I'm going to just record that on a, on a different camera, an HD camera. Yeah. See, none of that video noise on the live picture. The live picture is flawless. Now, a weird thing happened that kind of threw me off as, uh, as I was getting ready to take off, and people approached and we were walking by, and they were interested and wanted to watch the takeoff, so I said, sure. And then uh, I told them that there was a video monitor over there with a live uh, video and audio feed from the airplane. If they wanted to go stand over in front of the monitor and watch it uh, during the flight, they could. So they did. Uh, but I got a little distracted, so I was uh, flying closer to that, fleet, uh, that walking path there. I was closer to that than I wanted to be uh, early on in this video. And I was closer to uh, the group that was watching than I wanted to be early on in this video. But once I got myself walked out to the middle of the field, then we were in good shape after that. Again, none of that video noise is present when you're flying. When you're flying, it's like you're in a movie theater watching a movie uh, screen of somebody flying. And a big, a big thing that I learned is that uh, this, this, uh, this uh, diversity uh, dual uh, receiver slash uh, monitor has a, a search function. You hit search and it will automatically find the best, strongest uh, video uh, signal for you uh, by putting the uh, receiver on the best channel to give you the clearest video. So that's cool. That was a big uh, help too. That, that's improved things a bunch. Once I did that, once I let it pick the channel to use uh, for the best results, boy, that was that was a big breakthrough. All right, you can see by the attitude of the airplane, I'm starting to descend. You can hear the uh, revs of the, uh, the RPMs of the motor decrease, <coughs> decreasing. It is so much fun flying off the monitor live. You know, when you're getting the live, beautiful image, it is so much fun. It is so realistic. Uh, you can see things so much better from the airplane than you can from the ground. Your orientation, the obstacles to avoid, people to avoid. Here comes the landing now. FPV, baby. There we go. All right, so the signal uh, is all deteriorated now because the plane's on the ground. And the uh, receiver is up in the air a little bit. So, uh, but that's it. It's a great flight, and uh, there we go. Thanks for watching. Uh, next video, like I said, I'll post a video of the actual live video image, and you will be blown away. Thanks. See you soon.
Mark at RC Aviation and Coral Link Pacific Northwest signing off. I'm addicted to FPV flying, folks. I am so addicted. I am so addicted.